Hi, I'm Janice Gaines, recording artist and speaker, and this is our scripture for the day. Proverbs 3, 7 says, do not be wise in your own eyes, fear the Lord and shun evil. And what I love about the juxtaposition of this part of poetry, this piece of poetry here, is that it's telling us that to be wise in our eyes is actually like being evil. And you say, how is that evil? Why, why is it that strong? Well, consider the garden. Adam and Eve are in the garden and the Lord says, do not eat the fruit from the tree of the knowledge of good and evil because that will be taking your wisdom into your own hands, making yourselves the center, the reference for wisdom. And God is saying, don't do that. Instead, fear me, reverence me, be in awe of me and my wisdom. And when you do that, making God the center, that's how we're shunning the evil that tries to creep in and say that, oh, you can do things based on your own wisdom. You know enough when the reality is we don't. We even see it in Romans 12, 16, when it says, live in harmony with one another. Do not be haughty, but associate with the lowly. Never be wise in your own sight. Because being wise in our own sight, is what gets us in trouble. Social media gets us in trouble. The algorithm is built to make us feel wise in our own eyes. So beware there, because that's a very practical application where the evil tries to creep in. We make the Lord the center. He is where we find our wisdom.